Good afternoon, everybody. Welcome to today's Proverbs with Paul in the afternoon. This rather nice day, warm, dry, and a little bit of sunshine. Proverbs chapter 7, verse 8. All the words of my mouth are in righteousness. There is nothing crooked or perverted in them. All the words of my mouth so he's saying that i am confident that everything i say to you is right not wrong i wonder how many of us could say that the truth is that we all say things that we think oh perhaps i shouldn't have said that but here solomon is so confident that all the things he's instructing the young man he knows that he's instructing him in rightness, in righteousness. And righteousness is knowing what is right. And the way that we understand what is right and what is wrong, well, in these days, we measure it against human opinion. But in the beginning, God intended for us to measure right against the line of his right and wrong in the line against his wrong. So everything that God says and thinks is right because it's righteous and everything that's wrong, then my mate says wrongtious, meaning it doesn't reflect God. It doesn't look like God because it isn't anything to do with God. It's to the left, not to the right. So unrighteousness is not God's way. Righteousness is God's way. And then Solomon develops that and says, And this sense of being crooked. There's nothing crooked that comes out of my mouth. And the concept of crooked is something that's not straight. It has a twist to it. It has a swerve to it. It has a bend here and a bend there. And this sense of manipulating, as it were, truth. And we might ask, what is truth? Jesus said, I am the truth. And the reality of what he represented is truth. So anything that doesn't reflect the truth of what Jesus is, isn't truth at all. In fact, truth twisted is heresy. Heresy is a manipulation of the truth. And many people have taken the truth of the scriptures And they're using their own wisdom and manipulation and persuasions to deceive people into presenting a truth that supposedly has the flavour of truth. But when you examine it, you realise it's not true at all. In fact, anything that you believe that leads you into bondage or into an atmosphere that doesn't reflect the nature of God is not true at all. Because truth, Jesus says, will set you free. It will enable you to live life to the full. And if the truth that you believe is twisted or is heresy, then you will lead yourself into bondage. And bondage basically is very clear to see. It's ugly. It's isolated. It looks like Satan because the roots of its nature come from Satan. No, Solomon says, truth that's straight is righteousness. Thank you for joining me. Be blessed. Have a great day and I'll see you tomorrow.